And we're doing other things. The light bulb, uh, they got rid of the uh, light bulb that people got used to. The new bulb is many times more expensive. And I hate to say it, it doesn't make you look as good. Of course, being a vain person, that's very important to me. Uh, it's like, uh, it gives you an orange look. I don't want an orange look. <laughs> has, has anyone noticed that? <laughs> So we'll have to change those bulbs at at least a couple of rooms where I am in the White House. <laughs> we have a situation where we're looking very strongly at sinks and showers and other elements of bathrooms where uh, you turn the faucet on in areas where there's tremendous amounts of water, where the water rushes out to sea because you could never handle it, and you don't get any water. You turn on the faucet, you don't get any water. They take a shower and water comes dripping out. It's dripping out, very quietly dripping out. People are flushing toilets 10 times, 15 times, as opposed to once. They end up using more water. So EPA is looking at that very strongly, at my suggestion. Uh, you go into a new building or a new house or a new home, and they have standards, oh, well, you don't get water. You can't, you can't wash your hands, practically. There's so little water comes out of the faucet. And the end result is you leave the faucet on, and it takes you much longer to wash your hands. You end up using the same amount of water. So we're looking at, uh, very seriously, at opening up the standard. And uh, there may be some areas where we'll go the other route, desert areas. But for the most part, you have many states where they have so much water that it comes down. It's called rain, that they don't know, they don't know what to do with it. So we're going to be opening up that, I, I believe, and we're looking at uh, changing the standards very soon.